What's going on, the people of the internet? It is me, from Chris from Geeky Invasion, and today I'm bringing with you a DC Comics collector figures review, I guess. And obviously, this is Batman and Bane from the Arkham series, Arkham Asylum and City. And actually, I think it's from um, City because if you can see in the background, from my perspective, I can see the Arkham City stuff. I'll show you the box in a second. Um, this is what I kept from the box, and it's Batman and Bane. This is not from the Arkham Origins, because that is a different design of Batman, and it is the one voiced by Kevin Conroy, and it's my favorite design of Batman. So, I got this for Christmas, which was a really great present, and I was, at, I was with my mom at the time at the um, comic book store, and we were debating on which one was cooler, this one or the huge Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, Justice League set. I liked this one a lot because I'm a big fan of the Arkham series. And the Justice League one was like a lot of money. And this was a lot cooler, in my opinion. If I get the Justice League one, I'll review it. But I don't think I'll ever get it anytime soon. Maybe this Christmas, maybe. Which I don't want to think about. But yeah, let's get into this review. Um, we'll go on the box class. First, let's start out with Batman. Let's see if I can get some light on this. Got it. Okay, this is Batman. One thing you can give to DC is these things are sculpted beautifully. It's like amazing. Look at this texture. It looks like it just ah, oh, it's great. Let's start out with the arms, I guess. These can move. As you can see. We can make us move arms and move. I'd like to do a stop motion with these actually. That'd be cool. I've never thought of doing it with toys, like action figures. But these could work. It could work like that. So let's look into his face right now. His face is okay. He's like, it looks. His eyes are kind of blue and he looks like his mouth is frowning. But you know what? I really like this. It's really cool. Obviously, it's not the highlight of the set. It's my favorite. But everybody's, when they come to my house, dude, is that Bane? And they're all, like, amazed over that. Here's the back of it. And so, yeah, it's a very armored take on Batman. And it's for my favorite video game, Arkham City. I like it a lot more. I like Arkham Origins a lot, though. So, let's go over Bane now. We're going to have to. There we go. Bane is a friggin' tank. I mean... Oh, God. Let's, let's start out with the bottom. Okay. So, his feet. Very detailed. Very detailed with the feet. This can come out sometimes, but very detailed with the feet and stuff. His pants are orange, which indicates he's in Arkham City. Doesn't say Arkham on the sides or anything, but that's what it's implied. This is him jacked up on Titan, not the regular serum Venom. That, this is not Venom, this is Titan. Which makes him huge. Um, as you can see, in a moment, there's like this red stuff flushing through. It's actually quite hard to review this guy because it's so huge. He's so much huge. He actually sits on my shelf with Batman. So let's get the back of it. I'm lifting his wires and stuff so you can see the muscles and stuff. But look at this figure. I mean, like. God, I my preferred figure is Batman because I'm biased to Batman. But she's Louise. It's freaking huge. So let's let me show you the box really quickly. I guess here's my indication that it's Arkham because right here. Can you see that? It's the right here. Arkham. So, yeah. It's the inside of the box that I came with, and I guess. It looks pretty sick. So, indication, this was like about 60 bucks, I think. Didn't look at the price tag because it was Christmas. So, I bought this myself, I got it for Christmas, which was a really cool surprise because I didn't know I was getting this. I knew most of the presents I was getting, which was. It ended up being a really good Christmas. In my opinion, got bow and arrow, electric guitar, stuff like that. It was really, it was a really good Christmas, and so yeah. 
And I guess I can end this video off by saying, get this, get these figures. It's it's kind of expensive because all these collector's figures are very ex like kind of expensive, but they're worth having if you're a really good DC Comics fan. You can put this on your bookshelf. Just get them. They're really cool. And I think you should finish it off with like the Joker and Harley set and everything else. This is the only one I got because, I don't know, it's the coolest and I like Batman. So, got it, people. Um, live long and prosper.